Welcome back to Word of the Day, week five, day three. The word is harmonious. After the argument was settled, a harmonious feeling returned to the class. Aww. What do you think harmonious means? It's not sad. Like harmony? Yep, like harmony. Harmony means it's peaceful. peaceful or calm. So be in agreement or peaceful. Being in agreement. Or peaceful. Okay, this word is a noun, a verb, or an adjective. You are right, because it describes a noun. Synonym, what's another word that means harmonious? Harmonious. Um, what? Yeah, alliance is a good one. Like, you know, like Survivor, they get into an alliance, right? And they're like, oh, I'm working on your team, kind of thing. We gotta do antonyms now. Antonym. And all my hands went down, and then some came back up. Okay, but we're talking about antonyms. What's the opposite of being in agreement or peaceful? Yeah, okay, I'll give you noisy. But not being in agreement would be war or argument, arguing, right? War arguing or fighting. Who's going to use it in a sentence? Sorry. Have to get going with my job. The kid at school was very. Up. Uh, um, harmonious. Um, how about this? The kids. Okay, my house is not harmonious. The kids in my classroom know to be harmonious, right? Or you guys know Miss Richardson likes a harmonious room, right? You do know that, right? Okay. So then maybe I will draw kids sitting at their desks doing their jobs. Um, well, what are you thinking? My class last year was not harmonious. Okay. Well, we're not going to... Uh, see all your cute little heads being in harmonious. Hey, 
<laughs> isn't that so cute? It's so cute, isn't it so cute? I know. There y'all are at your desks. You're so cute. Well, I'm not going to put hairstyles on because we got other work to do. All right, we'll talk to you later. Bye.